hi guys welcome back to my channel thanks so much for stopping by if you are new then hi welcome to emmy's everything so today i am going to share with you my quarterly um weekly <laughs> my quarterly spreads so this is my erin condren life planner and i'm just going to show you how my weeks look um since January up until March. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the spreads from January to March 2016 in my Erin Condren Life Planner. This little pretty fancy case I received from my friend Stacy, and it is so, so pretty. So that is awesome sauce. So it's a nice little case, but then you could also hold things in here and there's a pen loop and it's just so pretty. So um, I just had the ready to ship life planner and I'm just gonna show you my spreads for the first three months of the year. All right, so I do have plan with me, I believe in for all of the weeks here. So if you wanna see the plan with me, then you can just search my channel. So um, like I said, this is the Erin Condren life planner and this hook is annoying. Okay, so January, this is what the monthly view looks like. I really wasn't using the monthly view for much, just decorating and putting some special events, I guess, but I don't have anything for January. And then I added this Erin Condren. Um, what is? What are these cards called? I don't know. It says you are sun kind of wonderful. So that's really pretty. So that is the January monthly. And then this is the first week. This first week, um, these stickers, like I said, if you want to see like stuff in detail, then you can check out the plan with me. But anyway, these stickers are uh, mostly from Naomi, from Naomi Plans. We did a swap and she gave me a whole bunch of like random Etsy stickers or random random stickers in general. So I use it in this spread. The next one I am using um, stickers from Sponsored by Coffee. She is Sponsored by Coffee on Etsy and then Official Sponsored by Coffee on Instagram. So I used um, her stickers but then I used some random icons from different places. So this was like a actually I feel like no the January colors are orange um, I don't know so this is like a peachy pink and blue theme and I love the this workout challenge from planet planet the next week this is from stickers for planners and this week was a lot busier this is when I was using um, this planner as my social media and YouTube planner. I kind of switched it later on in March, you'll see, but um, I'm using these stickers. I love these dinner stickers and these workout stickers from Plain Jane, the challenge from Planet Planet, and I just love how busy this spread looks. The next one is kind of boring. <laughs> So I guess I wasn't really like paying attention and jotting things down. That's why I switched over for my social media planner to go to my smaller planner. And then this is why, because like this says, I'm slacking. So this is green and peach. And then on the corners, I always use some sort of quote, quote or decorative element on the corner. So this spread is um, green and pink. And again, I use stickers from Sponsored by Coffee. I love her stickers. So that is green and pink. And then we're gonna move on to February. So this is February's monthly spread. Obviously, it is Valentine's month. So I had to decorate it for Valentine's and then it's my husband's birthday this month as well. So this is February. All right. I am very proud of this spread. I love it so much. This was my pen only spread. No stickers, no washi, just pens. And I love it. It brought me back to just using pens and, and colorful pens. And it was just, I really love this. And I'm gonna do this again someday. 
Next, it is Valentine's week, so I had to like let the pink and hearts and red and love just throw up in this spread. And actually, it was inspired by um, Sweet Bliss. She is Sweet Bliss on YouTube. I love how I do the flags here with all my sticky notes. And um, she inspired me to use my stash. And these are sticky notes. And these are like some Doris stickers that I received in swaps and, and stuff like that. So um, I just added this card because I just thought it was really pretty. And then the next spread it is green and pink and it's so pretty i love this enjoy inspire celebrate happy day um but then i also put a quote down here these stickers are from sponsored by coffee but then these stickers are from stickers for planners so i just thought that this spread oh and these camera stickers are so pretty where did i get those i don't know next this is another inspired by Sweet Bliss kind of planner and I feel like I keep rubbing my planner. So I used some washi tape. I did not use Etsy stickers in this planner. All right, so this was, like I said, inspired by Sweet Bliss here on YouTube. Um, I used sticky notes. I cut them up into these Erin Condren size squares and they're kind of off, but oh well. I used some washi tape and to-do notes so yeah i like it it's it's different it's not just bombarded with etsy stickers i like it i like changing it up sometimes because i use up my planner supplies and i change up the look of the planner so excuse me next is march this is going to be the last month i show you until my next quarter or if you want to go see my plan with me all right so this is march and it's pretty plain. And then I printed out this printable from the Hello Spring um, little promo from Ink and Wink. And this is from Carolina's Crafts. And so I just have this little Mambi magnet uh, page marker. I just thought it's pretty, so I left it there. And this is the first week of March. These stickers are from Libby and Co. And her stickers are really, really pretty. And I love the icon stickers. But um, her stickers are made like from like a vinyl or plasticky material that you need to use a Sharpie or permanent marker. And you have to let it dry or else it's going to smudge. So um, it's kind of a negative thing for me. So I basically used up the whole kit or almost the whole kit in this spread just to use up the stickers but it is really pretty and very very bright and then the next spread is like blah this week and the next week I kind of that's when I was like you know what this planner is just too big for what I want to use it for I need to move to a smaller planner and then I decided to use my Erin Condren Life Planner as my life planner <laughs> because it, I love the size for my everyday life, but for my social media, it was just too big. So yeah, this spread is blah. The next spread is like half blah and half okay. So this was the week of, of St. Patrick's Day. I used these date covers from, I have chocolate on my fingers. I did not even notice. So I use these date covers from Boulder Bond. I don't normally cover the dates because um, the date's are already there. <laughs> but I know it irks some people because of the colors and you want your spread to look cohesive and themed and everything like that. And this is really pretty. Like it's all green and like I didn't even have to carry uh, cover up the, the thankful thought because everything was green. So I thought that the colors were pretty and it, it worked well together um but other than that like well this is pink so it kind of matches um i'm trying to find a spread that like totally doesn't match and who cares uh, i don't know <laughs> i'll find one okay so next this is i love this this is when i finally um moved out 
and in. <laughs> I am using this as my everyday planner and it is working wonderfully and this is what I'm used to and I love it. So this spread was from Carolina's Crafts Printables from that Hello Spring thing that I bought. So I really love this. I really do. And I don't think that the dates like are totally ugly. I mean, the numbers are a different kind of green, but oh well. And then that is it. So that, um, what am I saying? Those are the spreads from January to March. So yeah, thanks so much for watching and and I enjoyed sharing it with you just to talk a little bit because most of the time I'm doing voice voiceovers or just playing music. So it was just nice to talk a little bit more. So that was my planner and this is my case. It's so pretty. And these, this is like one of my favorite pens. This is the Acro Ball from Pilot. I don't normally use ballpoint pens, but this one works perfectly and it fits nicely in my pen loop. And I love this case or this cover. It's so pretty and it's so girly. So that is it. And those are my spreads for the first three months of 2016. Bye guys.